There they are, the three crew members that will embark on Shenzhou 15, China's latest manned mission. Okay, we've already seen these three crew members. Yes, they were introduced to the world at a press conference before their trip, and now they are getting ready for their mission. As we mentioned before, uh, this is a new combination. Yes. Uh, and this combination uh, becomes, uh, you know, that during the Shenzhou 12, 13, and 14 mission, we always has two veterans and a newcomer. But this time, we change, return to uh, the configuration of one veteran and uh, two newcomers. Ah. Chief Commander, we are acting at the orders of Shenzhou 15 manned mission. Now we are ready. Please indicate. The crew and the member from Chinese People's Liberation Army Astronaut Corps, Taekwondo Fei Junlong, Deng Qingming, and Zhang Lu. Go. Yes, salute. On CGTN, you're looking at light pictures coming out of Jiuquan in northwest China's Gansu province, where crew members of China's Shenzhou 15 mission are being seen off at a send-off ceremony there. You Professor, you were talking about a new configuration, a new combination of one veteran plus two newcomers. Why the change here? This shows that our technologies already become very, very practical. You see that uh, in the uh, technology verification phase, and together with the uh, Shenzhou 14 mission, all the uh, during the, const uh, the first uh, part of the construction phase, you know that we must face many challenges and many difficulties. Mm. You see, for instance, the uh, the transfer uh, transfer of the position of the Wentian and the Mengtian module, as we have already uh, discussed. Uh, we mainly de depends on the uh, transfer uh, transportation mechanism. It is a very uh, specially designed robotic arm, but it is very small, only about 100 kilograms. So to use this mechanism to change the position of two body with a mass more than 20 tons, you may notice that we have never done this before. So it is really risky. Although we have backup measures, but you see that uh, to have veterans in uh, in the crew, we are facing many of the uncertainties. We can uh, we have the confidence to dealing with this kind of uncertainties, mm. uncertainties and challenges with more veterans mm. because you know that the in orbit environment is so different from that on the ground. Mm. So uh, so for these missions from the 2012, uh, or sorry, from the Shenzhou 12 uh, to Shenzhou uh, 14, we have two veterans. 